Hey everybody, it's Smooth Red here. I'm with uh, Lightweight Portable Security version 136. And to be honest, I have no idea what this is. I think I've downloaded it before and I've run it before, but I don't know. Uh, it could be that this one is the um, super duper awesome IDS out of the box. But <laughs> I cannot really remember anymore. Wow, cool. Sounds like a. Dude, did I get some military stuff? Where the hell did I get this one? Cool. Uh, yeah, sure. This is some awesome stuff, but, um, <laughs> that's funny. Uh, all right, one moment. I'll see if I can. Utilities display size. There we go. Not auto because you couldn't do auto. Let's do that one. All right. All right then. So, wow. What the fuck am I looking at? Really? I'm looking at something from the Air Force Research Department of Defense. Any anti-temper software protection technology office? Yeah, sure. Why not? Why not? All right. So we got um, Xterm and show desktop. It's built on BusyBox. Yeah, no problem. No problem. Can we do? We can run that. Yeah. So it's built on kernel two point six. It's not too bad. All right. Let's see what we got. Uh, it doesn't really like scroll with me. So we got an encryption wizard to encrypt or decrypt files. It looks very. Um, it it is Linux. No, don't get me wrong, but it looks very Windowsy. Uh, it looks like Microsoft, like <laughs> the old days of Microsoft. I don't know why they did that. Is it that so they can sell it some like internally or something? I don't know. Um, we got some documentation about, okay, yeah, what is this? Was developed by the, yeah, yeah, for the department of administration to secure unmanaged, unsecured, and other such home computers. Oh, okay, cool. All right, so, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. No problem. All right, this is the version from 14 September. So that's pretty latest, latest, latest. So we got DNS script. That's pretty goddamn awesome that they put that in there. Actually, uh, can we just enable it like just like that? Because that's that's pretty awesome. Apparently we can. Yes, cool. Check for open DNS. Welcome to open DNS. That's pretty, pretty awesome. So what do we got here? We got HTTPS everywhere. Let's just see what the Department of Defense thinks is secure. Not, not to be like um, degrading or anything, but I'm just wondering what they uh, what they like, as it were. Um, what, else do play? What, what else do you have on, on here? Funny. Trust domains only mill. <laughs> we got feral certificates, redirects, redetect smart card readers. Goddamn awesome stuff. I'm not even sure if I, I'm supposed to have this, but uh, we'll find out. Connectivity, they have a Citrix receiver in here, we have VMware clients, SSH, remote desktop for Windows, and why do they have ping in here? I don't know. Network proxy, that's pretty cool. But they have Citrix in here, so that's, uh, yeah, that's something you don't see at all in other um, distros that they have Citrix in there, which is a pain in the ass to configure, by the way. Um, no, no, this is. Well, as far as security goes, this is not actually not that bad. I mean, it's Linux. It has laser laser. It's got some uh, bare bone tools for security, like the crypt DNS. That's pretty awesome. 
uh, apparently they have an encryption wizard to encrypt files with. Um, Firefox has some settings on there that will al allow it to be more secure. And they have Mozilla here. So uh, use Smart Card and the Department of Defense LDAP. So that's pretty awesome as well. So that you, probably they can um, just like run this as it were. So if a custom server, I um, really actually wanna see what the server is and find that out, but I won't. Not right now, at least. So yeah, uh, this is lightweight portable security. Uh, apparently, a distro made by the Department of Defense. Um, SPI was SPI then. SPI is the Software Protection in in Institute or something. I don't know. Because that one is that's weird. Because you have the anti-temper software protection that is ATSP. But what does the I stand for then? Weird. Alright, not a problem. Anyway, that's it for me.